7 Reasons Why the T-Rex Was Probably a Scavenger Welcome back, dinosaur enthusiasts. Today we're diving into a controversial topic that has been the subject of intense debate among paleontologists and dinosaur enthusiasts alike. Was the mighty Tyrannosaurus rex a fearsome predator or an opportunistic scavenger hiding behind bushes until the dust settled? Well, grab your fossil digging gear and let's explore this fascinating question together. Reason 1. Its massive skull and bone-crushing teeth. The T-Rex's massive skull and large banana-shaped teeth were perfect for crushing bones. Unlike other carnivores with blade-like teeth designed for slicing flesh, T-Rex's teeth were robust and thick, suggesting they were adapted for breaking open carcasses to access nutrient-rich marrow inside. This bone-crushing ability is a classic scavenger trait, hinting at the T-Rex's potential scavenging lifestyle. This is our first clue that the T-Rex might not have been the active predator we often imagine it to be. Reason 2. It's energy efficiency. Hunting requires a massive amount of energy, and success isn't always guaranteed. As one of the largest land predators to ever exist, the T-Rex would have needed a lot of energy. Scavenging, a less energy-consuming activity, would have provided a more reliable food source. Reason 3. It's small and weak forelimbs. Despite their reputation, T-Rex's relatively small and seemingly weak forelimbs wouldn't have been effective at grasping struggling prey, a critical skill for a predator. But as a scavenger, no strong arms needed to feast on an already dead dinosaur. Reason 4. Its size and weight. T-Rex's gigantic size and weight would have made it difficult to be an agile, active predator. However, these traits would not have been a hindrance for a scavenger, roaming the landscape in search of already dead prey. Reason 5. Its sense of smell. While we can't directly study the T-Rex's sense of smell, their relatives, like modern birds and reptiles, have excellent olfaction. This would have been a critical advantage for a scavenger, allowing T-Rex to sniff out carrion from great distances. Reason 6. It's limited speed. There's much debate over how fast the T-Rex could actually move, with estimates ranging from 12 to 25 miles per hour. Some argue that even at top speed, T-Rex may not have been quick enough to chase down prey effectively. Scavenging doesn't require such speed. Reason 7. Evidence from the fossil record. The fossil record provides intriguing clues about the T-Rex's potential scavenging behavior. Paleontologists have discovered T-Rex tooth marks on the bones of various dinosaurs, including those that were likely too large or tough for the T-Rex to kill, such as the well-armored triceratops or the massive long-necked sauropods. In some cases, these tooth marks are on parts of the body that predators typically don't eat until the rest of the carcass has been consumed, like bone ends and fibulae. This suggests that the T-Rex may have been feeding on animals that were already dead and partially decomposed, a strong indicator of scavenging. There you have it. Seven reasons why the mighty T-Rex might have been more of a scavenger than a predator. And remember, the world of paleontology is full of ongoing research and debates. Perhaps T-Rex, like many modern animals, practiced both scavenging and predation depending on the opportunity. Whatever the case, the T-Rex remains one of the most fascinating creatures to have ever roamed the Earth. Stay curious. Keep exploring and remember, the past is never as extinct as it seems. Join us next time as we uncover more exciting dinosaur mysteries. If you enjoyed this video, buy me a coffee or a scotch. And consider subscribing for more awesome dinosaur documentaries. I'll see you soon.